what's going to happen if I apply a high force? I'm applying half millimeters each 15 days. Okay, so let's do it again. And of course, we need to adjust the height of the crown. And I'm doing the slow traction. Why is that? Because I want to, uh, the bone to follow the, the, the movement. And for that, for the bone to follow the movement, I need Prior to the, 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 the extrusion, the, the slow extrusion, the slow traction, I need to refer this patient to the periodontist, to the periodontist, so the periodontist will have, will uh, clean everything, will apply the, well, what they do, and give me back this patient with periodontal health. I don't mean without bone loss, but periodontal health. And then we do that slowly, slowly, half millimeter. I start using the, rec the, the round arch wire for that and it go very slowly. What's going to happen if I apply a high force? The movement probably will be the same. We'll have the bone following the movement, but not in the right magnitude that we want, okay? So we do that step by step, half millimeter every time, 